yet another ordinary morning in the city and yet another beautiful sunrise in the jungle of Tikala. An average human lives for 60 to 80 years, but do we really live every day of our lives? We can all agree that there are very few memorable moments in our lives which we cherish more than anything else. For us, those moments are from the mornings in the forest. The funny thing is, we have never used an alarm to wake up in the jungle. The excitement, the passion and the hunger to see wildlife wakes us up every day. Hello wildlife lovers and welcome back to episode 6 of the Tikala Wildlife series from Discover Wild Paws. Before we begin this beautiful morning safari with you all, we request you to subscribe to our channel Discover Wild Paws. This will keep us inspired to create more wildlife content for you all. And if you like what you see, please share our videos on Facebook and WhatsApp. Now let's begin our safari. The jungle is very interesting in the morning. The birds are active and sing to the beautiful sunrise. The prey is happy because they have survived yet another fearful night in the jungle. The morning dew makes the grass and leaves shine and you can hear the crunching sound of deer grazing and the best part is there is no city noise. This was our third day in the park and we were supposed to leave the next morning. We wanted to treasure every second we spend here to take back with us to our routine urban life. And where else we could go? If you have followed this series from the start, you must have recognized this place by now. Yes. This is the Ram Ganga River near Sambar Road. Jim Corbett is an evergreen forest and the reason why this side of the park is so famous is that there is more visibility to find the tiger. Can you guess one thing which Jim Corbett has in abundance but Ranthambore National Park does not have at all? Let us show you the other king of this park, the mighty one. This is a male tusker elephant. Its glowing white teeth made us wonder what dental routine does he follow. Maybe it's the sugar-free diet. Jim Corbett is home to more than 600 elephants. These elephants wander from here to Rajaji National Park throughout the year. Elephants are the mega gardeners of the wild. With their huge tusks and enormous strength, they form the ecosystems. They live in herd and protect their young ones like a family. There is so much to learn from these elephants because these giants have seen a different perspective of the world altogether. Yet, for ages now, they have been hunted for ivory. The forest department is forced to take strict measures to protect them. They have to cut down their tusks to protect them from poaching and fatal fights among themselves. Now just look at this, a wild elephant entering its private pool. Who says being fat means being unfit? Elephants are great swimmers. They use their trunk as a breathing device, popping out of water for oxygen. And slowly, the other members of the herd joined the pool party. One after the other, they entered the water to cross the Ram Ganga River. Do you know that elephants have been known to swim for 50 kilometers or 6 hours straight without any rest? That's how strong they are, even underwater. They use all four legs to push themselves forward and breathe in regular intervals by popping out half their face and trunk outside the water surface. But something felt strange. It is a winter morning of December and there seems to be ample food on the other side of the river. They could have peacefully enjoyed their breakfast. 
yet they choose to swim across in this cold water. What could be the reason behind that? The reason is visible on the screen, but can you guys see it? This brings us to another piece of key advice for jungle visits. When visiting places like Jim Corbett, where the distance between the jeep and the animal can be a lot, it is important to have some kind of telephoto lens or binoculars. Now this is the same frame as before, the difference being the earlier one was a mobile shot and this one is a telephoto lens shot. If you cannot arrange for a wildlife lens, an alternative is to use binoculars along with the mobile camera. Paru, the queen of Corbett. She was the reason why elephants cross the freezing river early in the morning. When elephants are with young ones, they usually avoid tiger encounter. As she went back behind the tall grass, other jeeps gathered. It was not only the elephants who crossed the river in fear, there were other species too. Because this one was in a mood to hunt. Stay with us in episode 7 of the series to watch what happened next. And yes, if you have not already, watch episode 1 to 5 of the series as well. We will be back soon with more such wildlife content. Till then, keep discovering wild pause.